Yeah, no kidding. I'm going to be a couple different people right now, okay? Hi, my name is Hollis. Since she can't be here, Hollis, as most of you know, is the one that talks to us about Narcon training. It's, the, it's a different name than Narcon, but you know what it is. It reverses an opioid overdose. It brings people back to life. So if anybody would like to partake of that, her meeting is seven minutes long, and you just got to get a hold of her. If you don't know who she is, come to me and I'll find her. The other thing that she always talks about is sharps. That's another name for needles. We do have a sharps container in the admin corner of the tent. That's not saying go get needles and bring them in and put them in there. That's for us. Hollis will go after needles. If you find them, mark your GPS. You can come and get her or anybody in the admin building, Seth or myself, Hollis, Luann, right here, any of us, and we will make sure that someone goes out to get those. We do not want you touching anything like that. And keep in mind that includes like bottles of liquid. We don't always know what's in those. So you might want to be careful with those as well. So that's Hollis, okay? So Hi, every morning. <laughs> so every morning we can stand back here and uh, listen to the meeting. So even if uh, people are up there videoing and you guys don't see us, we are participating, but we're just back here. Cut or a splinter where you open the skin. We want to tend to that. There's nothing I hate hearing worse than I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Okay. No, you're not fine. We want to take care of things. We have one gal that comes to the meetings occasionally that suffered from MRSA and lost her leg. And some of you know who she is. She comes around here. That was what it was from. If you get the tiniest piece of glass or the tiniest splinter, let us take care of it, please. We have people that can tend to it. We have people that are retired professionals that can help you out. So please come to the tent or admin and we'll make sure you're taken care of, okay? bird on a tree Mr. Scotty was the uh, I think you were the winner of the cleaner upper in our group <laughs> yeah he uh, we were all kind of goofing around talking having fun as we were uh, cleaning Scotty was kind of on a mission <laughs> he was way ahead of us uh, pulling all kinds of stuff out of the out of the washes and we all got a lot of garbage but Scotty was really pulling it out of the out of the bushes and stuff so Stepping it was very nice up. yeah you did a wonderful <laughs> job Scott and I showed you guys I think in the other video where's your little treasure that you found well, it's hanging on the back of the rig oh it is all yeah. right I'll show you it's is uh you want to grab it you want to grab yeah. it kind of cool. I don't know um, if you didn't watch the last video yesterday. Hey. Yeah. It's been see. around for a little while. I don't know. I mean, that one's just paper thin. Sun is. Yeah. It's really cool, actually. I don't have my glasses on, guys, so I'm having a little bit of a hard time it's, seeing if this is even, you I think know. it's like from logs or something like that. Yeah. It's, it's something, something old. But it's, it is. It's really old. Yep. Um, We've had a few complaints about my videos being out of focus. I am really sorry. I cannot see, um, even with my glasses on, I think i got to get stronger glasses because I can't always tell when it's out of focus. And I'm, I have 150s on, but sometimes I really can't see the screen. So, anyways, what's new in the, new in the zoo? I'm going to tell you what's new in the zoo. See my new carpet? Mm -hmm. Um... I got this from a viewer, Teresa, and she has become our friend. She's actually traveling with us, which is fun. She's got a lot of spirit and just a really happy-go-lucky kind of gal, and that's always fun to be around. Anyway, she bought me this uh, carpet. I just got hers over there. The dogs just love it. They're all rolling around. We do have to be careful that the dogs don't come and piddle on it, and we've... We've been we've we've had good luck at that, so we kind of shoo them off of there. But yeah, the winds were high yesterday, so the it looks a little little uh, messy down there. But yeah, we had our Christmas lights up, we had our grass out, we all sat by the fire one night, and yeah, about ready to take all this stuff down. And I think we may be moving in the next couple days. It's been fun out here with everybody, but I don't think we're going to stay till the very end. Um, we want to go and do a few things, so we'll let you know, of course, if we're going to take off. But 
That might be the plan. We might be taking off and going somewhere for the new year. They do have a New Year's Eve party here. Um, <laughs> I'm not sure Scotty and I want to be uh, right here during New Year's Eve. We're just not sure. And uh, wherever we end up for New Year's, we'll definitely be taking you guys with us. All right, well, that's the end of my morning. I'll see you guys this afternoon, maybe. All right, guys, so uh, Tara and I are going to go for a walkabout, pick up a little more garbage. I got my borrowed super picker-upper. Terry has hers over here. She's in the middle of talking with Oz right now. And Ross is busy doing comments. So we're going to do another walkabout, pick up a little more garbage. I think they're getting another garbage can. And uh, they are getting a lot of stuff here. So let's take a walk. <laughs> So They're pulling it down. That's all that matters. Hey, that's the good store right there. Yep. Yeah. Some more workers. Yep. Very cool. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Don't get ran over. You can see all that dust down there. They are dragging a huge, um, huge thing of uh, wire and piles of, wire, pile, yeah. piles of wire like fencing and stuff which kind of grates the road out a little <laughs> but it kind of dusted us out which is okay and let's see we've got we've got a little bit of stuff in our bag so far cans and I don't know if you guys can see that I got some paper and some plastic pipe you well, know, we notice that a lot of it's in uh, where the trees are. They pick it up, but also right. it's all, all over the ground too. But all right, it's getting better and better and better. There are a lot of YouTubers out here filming. <laughs> you might get tired of seeing us all cleaning up. I don't know, but um, it's part of our life. This is what we are doing right now. So that's what we're going to show you. And I challenge everyone that's watching to go out and pick up some garbage today pick up a bag yeah you don't have to pick up a whole bag just go out and pick up a couple things and get them in the garbage or the recycling bin whatever and everything helps and it's good for walking for us yes it is good for walking good exercise Well, we haven't, we've made it a little ways, um, past the bus up there. Um, we keep getting stopped by people <laughs> visiting, visiting with people who watch us. So that happens. Scotty and I are kind of used to that. Here, how about if I put my bag down and then I, I help pick up the glass with you. Oh, I didn't see that. Yeah. Um, we're used to getting stopped like that, but sometimes it takes us forever to get from point A to point B. Oops. These things are awesome for picking this stuff up. Yeah. And it's about... Well, we love talking to everybody. I do. I do. I know you do, too. I do. Sometimes I get... I guess you would call it long-winded. <laughs> <laughs> ah, 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 ah. This is mine. Okay. No, I'm kidding. Okay, I think we... Oh! Oh no, I thought that was some wire. My eyes, are, my eyes are not the greatest out here because I have my... Oh, here. I have my sunglasses on so I can't see very well. Well, yours works awesome, too. Yeah, there's lots of... Yep. Glass out here. Hey, we, yeah, see, I can we really... have a new profession. Garbage picker up. Yeah, look at that. Wow. I've, been, I've been cleaning up garbage for all my life. My, my parents taught me very well. Thank you, Mom and Dad, uh, for teaching me to respect our land. And Ooh, that's a, that's a oh, hook. That's a hook. That could be recycled for something, actually. I'm trying to think what I can use that for. Uh, my parents taught me years ago to uh, come into somewhere, leave it better than you found it. Um, 
that's the one thing my dad and I, when we would go camping together, <laughs> we always would uh, clean up an area, and it was so neat. Oh, yeah, see, golly, what's he dragging there? Something. <laughs> Definitely grading the road. <laughs> I don't know what in the world that is. Goodness sake. Yeah, leaving an area better than we found it, and we would definitely do that. It was always nice to uh, go back and see how other people treated it, and a lot of times you'd go back and the area was uh, kept up even better than even better than how we left it because they just continued to get more and more garbage out of there. Oh, here's something. Nasty, then you, you, you don't really care, which is a shame. Yeah, some people. These are sterno cans. Yeah. This uh, made me just kind of think about how, how they treat Mount Everest, where they just leave all those bottles up here. Um, these are definitely from campers. Uh, sterno. Sterno cans. Please, pick up your stuff when you leave your campsite. Uh-oh. I'm stuck. <laughs> well, I think I found the place to fill our bags up on. Yeah. I just walked over here. This tree is littered with that. On the far side, so I think that's going to fill our bags up. Uh, it's on the windy side. But, uh, yeah, but I see. I see more over here. Oh, how old? Can I can I look at it? Yeah. Might be really old. Huh. I don't have my glasses on, but it's a mason jar? Does it say mason on it? It doesn't look like a mason jar. Ooh. Pokies. These are these bushes are got thorns on them. Um I mean it's kind of weird shape. Maybe it's an old peanut butter jar. I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna knock the dirt off so I'm not careful kind of dirt around it is kind of an odd shaped jar yeah okay i mean it's been here for a while to have all this dirt on it i doubt it's anything but i don't think so i don't think it is oh i got the hiccups because of the way i don't on cap like that well i don't know i don't know much about antiques so Bigger tree, but oh, yeah, the there's lots and lots of garbage. Oops, what's this? Oh, I, kinda... oh, I don't know what that is. Oh, yeah, lots of lots of ickies. Okay, oh. these things are awesome. Oh my gosh, there's so much glass out here. Yeah. I just cannot believe how much glass. Oh, and the trees are relentless. To... <laughs> now, I don't know. Oh, how do you get in here? I'm gonna have to knock the dirt off. It's kind of really weird. Heavy. Yeah. Okay. You'll do that for me. Yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, this, some of this stuff has been out here a long time. Yeah. And the glass, is, well, the, the metal. I, I mean, looking at it, it's, it's kind of rot away, but. And I think that they are working on recycling down there, just to let everyone know. Um, I asked them yesterday, but the gal I asked didn't, wasn't real sure what was going or the gentleman wasn't real sure what was going on about that yet. But 
right off. This is an odd rock. Right there. Something. Yeah. Something's in that. That's a... Odd. Yeah, the big trees are where all the garbage seems to. Well, it's gonna blow around. Go. Let's see if I can get in here. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. The big part about it is that these trees are not friendly <sighs> to be messed with because they. No, we gotta be careful. Yeah. Oh, that got me. Yeah. Um, and they. They sting too when they poke you. The I don't know what it is that's in it, but it it really honestly uh, stings you for a while. Oh, now these are full of dirt, babe. Okay, that was... they're in the they're in the. Oh, ow, ow, ow! Shoot, yeah, that poked me. Oh, poked me in the forehead. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, sorry, I'm moving you guys all around. Oh, there's something. I don't know what that is. Oops, lost it's, it. It's a treasure. <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm moving you guys all around. I'm sorry. And believe it or not, this is almost, as, this is fun. This is not work. This is what's funny. Yeah. We were going to turn you guys off way down there. We <laughs> said, okay, we're going to turn you guys off so we could do this. But I don't know. We love having you guys along yeah. with us. It's really, uh, oh. Yeah. Some days we say, we're not going to film, and then all of a sudden we're filming because we miss you guys. <laughs> Scotty's like, I don't have anyone to, nobody's leaving me comments to talk to. And even though they're short little comments back, you got to remember we've got so many. We have, we have the comments on the, on YouTube. We've got, oh, here's a big thing. Hang on. Look at this. Um, comments on YouTube. We got, is that anything good? Mm. No, well, it was at one time, but... Okay. Oh. Somebody could do art with that or something. I don't know. Um, and then we've got Instagram and Facebook, which I don't answer too much on Facebook and Instagram. I I really don't know how to work those um, social media sites very well, guys. And then we have... Oh, we have a lot of people who like to write in on... Uh, private messages, which takes me a long time to get, you know, private emails. That takes me a long time to get back to. And some people have our phone number um, that I actually no longer give out um, because that became kind of an all-day thing where people were texting me and I, I just can't get back to everybody. And I don't text. And Scott doesn't text. So... That is something that I've decided I'm not going to give out our phone number anymore because I just I can't keep up with it. I feel bad when I can't reply back. So, oh, I think we I think we got it. Oh, well, and actually, in all honesty, the phone number is for um, our, our family to get yeah. a hold of and stuff like that and for us to find information. But. Okay, I think we... <laughs> I think we got it all I guys a great job on the that tree is cleaned out in there i think the wash, I can tell now, looking at the wash goes down this way right so oh yep yeah, that's where all the garbage it's, is it's all right in this wash because all of a sudden i'm seeing batteries and stuff here <laughs> somebody told me one time um Maybe this is where the gold is. That, yeah this is where you need to have your metal detector well, after I that's what jay was telling you other people are telling you, this is where you need to do your metal detecting. I know, but... Um, somebody said to us one time, we don't care what you put out there, we'll follow along and we just find it interesting what you guys do. Well, this is what we do. <laughs> Sometimes it's not all about the editing and um, pretty, pretty landscaping. This is what we're really doing in our day today. But this Golly. Is fun. Well, I don't know if everybody finds picking garbage up fun. 
<laughs> what if you find a treasure? Well, you it's found a great treasure there. yesterday. So, that was like an awesome treasure. We're going to actually take that hook. I don't know. Hey, if any of you guys um, are into antiques and you've ta you took a look at that uh, hook that Scotty found, we don't really know if it's worth anything or if it's old. But if you know, why don't you leave us a comment? Uh, we'll take it on into someone to have them look at it. Might not be old at all, but uh, it's a pretty cool find. It's neat looking. I like it. Oh, all I right. I might be putting it um, up for sale. I think <laughs> it's cool. It reminds me of old boat stuff and logging stuff. There you go. And it's a memento. Here, Whatever here's some is. more garbage. There's a lot of bad. It's a memento that you're going to put up for sale, huh? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's an old Copenhagen yeah. container. I think so. Ooh, my bag's getting heavy. I know, I'm finding a lot of batteries right. here in this water. Honey, uh, I think we gotta go. Yeah. We gotta we gotta get down there and get this in the garbage and I need to go cook. Alright guys, we're turning you off for good. We'll see you guys down there. No, we're not turning you off. We're just gonna say uh see you later. Yeah, we'll see you down <laughs> at camp. I wanna save my bag. Oh yeah, oh. Okay. Well, it's, all right. Uh, it's, there's some tan and there's, there's some, all kinds of stuff in it. There's all kinds of crap in there. Uh, just go ahead and put it right okay. there. Okay. There's a lot of metal. Is that what you guys are doing? Throwing metal over there? Yeah. All right. Well, so this is what they've got today. Even more. All right. So they are. They're trying to recycle because they're going to take this down, I believe. Um. We're going to take this stuff down to the scrapper, so that's good. That that relieves some of the yeah, I don't want to take stuff the in there. Well, I think yours, yours Scotty is mostly and I, crap. Scotty and I want to uh, keep our bags. So we're just going to throw it in there. All the volunteers. Let's see how much is in there today. Oh yeah, my gosh, look at that.